So I'm watching the keynote right now because I missed it last month. But yeah, this is another time which I can use to record another video. And this time it's all about the Razer again. And yeah, 4.4.4 um, got announced and I will attach this camera right now live. <laughs> Yeah, great, it works. So 4.4.4 is now also on the Razer forums. Um, it's just a safety update if you wonder why Google has decided to do another update. 4.4.3 uh, was amazing, it ran smooth. KitKat is amazing, so 4.4.4 is now available to the public. And uh, yeah, 4.4.4 includes several safety updates like login features and um, login bugs where you log into like Play Store or Gmail and uh, several other security stuff. So no stuff you can actually see on your phone. Um, it doesn't affect the user. It does not affect any design features or or anything, just internal safety updates. So yeah, this is Liquid Smooth 4.4.4. I hope this will be smoother than any other version before. And it is really great ROM. And if you don't know Liquid Smooth, the main goal of Liquid Smooth team was to create ROM, which is minimalistic, um, um, but you don't have to understand it like minimalistic in customization, but minimalistic in the structure of the ROM, which makes it very fast. So the internal stuff in this ROM is really um, made to made to be very fast. And um, customization is like in AOKP and other good ROMs like um, Pac-Man ROM and yeah, you have very much customization going on here. So you can, for example, go to interface, but first of all, I will show you the lock screen in this ROM, which also includes this great widget, which shows you the weather temperature. I have to change it to Celsius. This is now Fahrenheit and this is my Gmail. You can also slide in your um, new notifications so like a uh, gmail you can also swipe it to the left and make it disappear completely now let's unlock my phone this is a gray wallpaper but this is the stock one which comes with all 4.4 roms and i will show you now other wallpapers which come with this rom there's a picture of me great um this is liquid papers you have a great selection of wallpapers here, but um, I experienced a very dull and uh, very pixel pixelated pictures here. I think the size is not the right one for this phone of these wallpapers. I think they are low resolution wallpapers. Like for example, if we choose this one, which I like, we set as wallpaper and uh, it says wallpaper set and yeah it's kind of blurry it's not very sharp but yeah I like it very much this wallpaper and you can see that liquid smooth letters are not centered but yeah we have to live with it so let's go to settings again and now I will show you interface uh, you can change the density, that's re really cool. Um, maybe I can show you what I mean by clicking 300. And it should be bigger now. Yeah, it is. And you can also go for 200, which makes everything smaller. And when you have a phone with a bigger screen real estate, like the Note or your Nexus 5, this comes in handy because you can see more on your big screen, which makes it more usable and more user friendly. Uh, clock widget, you know this, and um, this is new, I think, or I didn't cover it. 
in the uh, previous ROM reviews of Liquid Smooth. I also have a Liquid Smooth 4.2.2 on my on my YouTube account, which you can also check out if you see some differences. Of course, design is different, but they are both really fast. And uh, when shaken horizontally, you can kill the app. Wow, that's great. Let's check it out. Doesn't work, of course. Um, default. Okay, maybe I look like a noob here, but it should work. It should work. Maybe after reboot, I don't know. Horizontally is like this and not like this. But it doesn't work either way. So um, go for lock screen now. Style. There's so much to um, to cover here. Lock handle icon. We can ch uh, go for liquid icon, which I like. <clears throat> Yeah, this looks cool. And you can also change the transparency, the blur radius. See through. Blur radius. Yeah, you can see through uh, your lock screen and you can see the app behind it. Which is really nice, but I don't like it. <laughs> lock handle icon, we covered that. So this is all for lock screen, check it out. So customization is amazing in this ROM. Battery around ring. I like that because it reminds me of Emma UI, which is the um, last, uh, the recent ROM review I made. Emma UI 4.2.2, really fast ROM. You have to check it out, go to navigation and you can change all the hardware buttons on this phone also backlights and custom actions for your different soft buttons or hotkeys as you also call them pi control you can enable pi let's enable it and we should have it around here yeah there there it is that was it. Yeah, there it is. Pi control, it's um you can also trigger it here. It doesn't work. <laughs> Great. So that's your clock and your network you're in. And you can edit all these um hot all these um links here. So you can go back to home and recent apps. And I don't want to extend this one review like 12 minutes. It's like 8 minutes and I didn't cover all features yet. Um, these, get in, these are getting too long in the past. But uh, I don't know. If you like long ROM reviews, just write it in the comments. I I would like to know that. Active display... It's really cool. Also available on on uh, Motorola phones like Moto X. Performance, I think you can cannot change much here. Of course, it um, it requests super user access. This remember choice forever. Allow kernel tweaker, so you are not able to to do anything but you can see the deep sleep status of your phone which is really good and you can see that it's on 300 megahertz 70 percent and yeah i just powered on this phone it was not in sleep so that's really um good to see that um, everything works on uh, 300 megahertz most of the time Status bar, um, favorite thing that I do is change battery icons all day long. Icon with battery uh, percentage. 
uh, circle with percentage. I like this the most. You can also change battery color. Let's go for bright red. And that works flawless. Circle animation sh uh, speed. You can also change that fast. I think it is for um, charging your phone. So you can do a lot on this on this great ROM. Liquid Smooth, I recommend all the different ROMs like 4.1.2, 4.2.2, 4.3, and now also KitKat. Very great thing to have. Status bar hidden, you can also hide your status bar if you enable expanded desktop, which you can do in your power menu if you enable it. Notification count. Visible. Um, let's go to total blackout. I wanted to show you that. That this is um, also available in other ROMs. Like every ROM has it. Everything will be blacked out. So it's nothing special really, but um, looks really good. I have to say. Go to settings once again and uh, total blackout. Let's disable it. Uh, themes, of course, you can add every theme from the Play Store, which is working on 4.4 ROMs like CyanogenMod, and all your AOKP uh, themes will work on this ROM. Now we go for interface once again and go for power menu. Okay. Plus expanded desktop. So you can add several different things here. You can also go for a custom app, which is really cool, and um, go to applications. Like if I use uh, Gmail all the time, or let's say Google, you can actually uh, save it. Don't forget to save it. Save it. Where is save? Oh, you don't have to save it, okay. So now you can go to your power menu and then there's the custom app you add it there. You add there, um, you can add every app from your um, app drawer. This comes in handy, I think. Um, so let's say you are in a game and you quickly want to Google something. You can do that now and yeah, great thing. So this is very customizable, this Liquid Smooth 4.4.4 ROM. So latest safety features, latest Liquid Smooth 3.0 update, and uh, I can show you the Android version. This is the Liquid Smooth logo, which is not high resolution whatsoever. But yeah, looks really good. Um, so guys, check out this great ROM. I will cover more ROMs. 4.4.4 uh, is now in the Droid Razor forums and um, other ROMs will now use the same base for this ROM. So stay tuned. I will cover more and install this ROM and check out all the great customization features on this ROM yourself. And I wish you have a great day. And um, see you in the next one. And yeah, maybe you write a comment or like this video or subscribe to my channel, which would be really good. And I thank all the subscribers, which are now part of my channel, so to say. And yeah, thank you for your support. And I will see you in the next ROM review. Hey guys, it's good to see that you are still here. But I want to show you... Um, that I figured out how to use the shake mechanism. Um, it now works. I just figured it out. So you have to shake really hard and it works. Great. This was one thing I wanted to show you. And yeah, if you wonder why it hasn't worked in my review. So now see you in the next one.